So, hey guys on YouTube, this is Mac. Um, on Saturday, the December, uh, I don't remember, but me and our late league team, uh, RoboStorm, we went to Peoria for the, uh, the, uh, what's it called? The regionals thing, so, the regionals competition. So, when we go, when there's pictures, I'm going to do this because pictures don't have sound. So the video's coming up, so bye. You could, like, get a charger thing. Yeah, put a ceiling charger up. And she'll come over. Hey, guys. The first place is 217. Uh, someone got 80. No. First place is 412. You can beat that. You don't want to, at least. You think I'm just going to be cold? Oh, we could be higher. Come on, Brandon. Okay. It's all on camera. It's on my scrub. It's on here. Yep, and I'll be posting it. Okay. <laughs> the Hat Man Cooper. Do I have hat hair? Yeah, a little bit. Somebody up there. Oh, hey, baby. 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 Oh, hey, so we tell them. So we tell them. We are the Robostorm. We are the Robostorm. Mighty, mighty Robostorm. Mighty, mighty Robostorm. Who? Oh, oh, yeah. Who? Oh, oh, yeah. What time is it? Time. Lego time. time! Oh, they're playing good for that. Hold the box so it doesn't tip over. Oh, yeah. oh, Good luck. Good luck. Sorry. 
breakfast tables. <laughs> Thanks, you too. Thanks. You did a good job. says that we're in second place. So, yeah. Oceanic, oceanic, atmospheric events. 
Dr. Byron Austin, who works at the Goddard Space Center about National Weather Service satellites. I need to pay better attention to these warnings. Do you all go with me to Oslo and see this? All start walking on the yellow brick road. Suddenly, Glenda comes in. Dorothy, what are you doing back? I was in another tornado. When the National Weather Service issues a tornado warning, you have an average 13 minutes to take cover. But there's a 70% a chance of a false alarm. According to meteorologist and storm chaser Chloe Martin, when a warning is issued, most people do not take cover. In some places, the sirens go off countywide and people ignore them. Colby informed us that for this reason, the National Weather Service recently started using polygons to more accurately show the warning area. These storm-based warnings were implemented in 2008. Emergency Response Manager Chief Tom Sipkin of Knox County, Illinois, sends storm chasers out if the National Weather Service of Lincoln, Illinois has sent him a notification of an approaching storm. All arrive at the gate to Ops. We need to see the gate to Powell's alive. He needs to be able to just phone things. Yeah, that's right. Please let us see the wizard. I need to get home. Let me give him a call. Huh? Hey, man, uh, those same four call makers are back. Yes, great and powerful eyes. I am back. I have learned so much from my friends about tornadoes. Do you have a smartphone with me? Yes, I do. There are several apps out there that will help you when you invent a new tornado. One called Tornado Alert, which alerts you that the tornado is present in up to a 20 mile radius. There is an amazing new app called RSTS, which stands for Robo Storm Tornado Scanner, created by the Robo Storm FLL team. This app helps you determine where the tornado is at and gives you information on what to do and how to get away. Wait, let me explain it to you using this flowchart. We have a tornado, it is spotted by the National Weather Service radar on the spotter, and goes to the National Weather Service app, which eventually goes to TV stations, radio stations, cell phones, and other media. Here's where app comes in. Our app calculates your GPS coordinates compared to that of the tornado and tells you how to get away and other options. Yeah, no wow, I didn't know there was an app for that. Can you explain how it works on my phone? Let me have my awesome wireless representative explain it to you. Dorothy, you take your smartphone and wave it around until you line up the tornado with the arrows and tell you how far away it is, where it's going, and how to get to a shelter. Ooh, let me explain the navigation. If I was traveling on the yellow brick road, I'd be right here. If this is a tornado right here, and these red lines indicate the path of the tornado, this orange box-like figure is a polygon that the National Weather Service issues. This black line tells me where to go to get to a shelter to stay safe. Do you know there's no such an amazing app? Yes, the Robo Storm Shader idea was with Colby Martin, Byron Austin, and many others. Uh, can you help me? Robo Storm Tornado Scanner application created by the first Lego League team.